The gospel really teaches us that we have a Heavenly Father that loves us, and I feel my parents reflect and emulate this great love. Because of that love, my parents and my Heavenly Father want me to be the best person I can possibly be. And that's why education is so important and so emphasized in the gospel and in my family. The church greatly stresses the importance of gaining an education and helps us to understand that it's necessary to learn as much as we can about as many different aspects of this life as we can. One of the central tenets about education in the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints is that the glory of God is intelligence. We're told to seek learning by study and also by faith. It's a combination of the secular and the spiritual that makes a whole. From its earliest days, the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints has been deeply committed to education. Indeed, one of our prophets, Brigham Young, said that we are to gather up all learning and to treasure it. There's a very powerful Latter-day Saint tradition in promoting education for women. One of the evidences of the commitment of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints to education is this campus, Brigham Young University, the campus in Hawaii, the campus in Idaho, LDS Business College, and the extensive Seminary and Institute program. I really do feel the commitment that the church has to education here at BYU. And it's really important to me because I value education, and I feel that it not only helps in the classroom, but outside as well. Those who are knowledgeable in American higher education um, know that not only the good that's being done at BYU, but the high quality of education that's provided. And I love the fact that uh, they compete at a high level academically and at the same time remain true to their faith heritage. I think that's powerful. Many people are familiar with the universities that the church has, but in fact, the church has an institute program which provides opportunities on campuses all around the world. The combination of secular and spiritual learning that happens through having institute study while I'm here at Harvard is really important to me. It's really great to have the church educational system that can provide church institute classes that are spiritually uplifting and really supportive of the academic environment. One of the things I like about being a member of the LDS Church is that the pursuit of academic excellence and the pursuit of my understanding about God reinforce each other rather than contradict each other. I'll have Jake give the opening prayer. I serve in the church currently as a seminary teacher. It's like a early morning Bible study for the youth. Every morning before school, the youth of the church will wake up extra early and get to the church building by 6.30 in the morning where I'm there waiting to teach them for about 40 minutes of time out of the scriptures and uh, teaching them principles that will help them to uh, live better lives. One of the invitations that the Savior gave to his disciples was to follow him. And one of the great things about his life is that he was always seeking to understand the things that his father would have him learn. And then he also demonstrated that the reason we need to learn is so that we can bless the lives of others. Our motto at the entrance to campus is enter to learn, go forth to serve. That's very much built on the life of the Savior, what he did in his life and what he taught his disciples. I think when we learn things, we try to become a better person. Because of the church's focus on education and because in many areas of the world, there were members of the church that really didn't have an opportunity to get any education to further themselves and their families. The church introduced the Perpetual Education Fund, which is a way for an individual to receive a loan from the church, to receive some training and education, further themselves, and then repay that loan to help other students do the same thing. One of the most touching things is to hear the stories of these young people who really were at a dead end. And yet with, with a small loan, their lives have been transformed. One has the desire to do many things, but sometimes we don't have the resources. I feel very happy because I have seen that my son has been able to learn so much. This program has helped him to study 
and to obtain a job. Latter-day Saints believe that education is at the heart of our existence because the heart of education is seeking to develop all parts of your being, not simply sitting in classes, but becoming a lifelong learner, improving our abilities and capacities to understand the world better and to live the principles of the gospel of Jesus Christ.